Hi! From this tutorial, you can learn how to use JetElements Advanced Map module to add a map to your website's page. First, we need to open WordPress dashboard. Here, open Elementor JetElements settings. As you can see, the API key field is empty. Let's add a new API key to this field if you have one or create an API key to input it here. If you don't have the key, then click on the link on the API key option. You'll be redirected to the page where you can get a new key. Please click on Get a key button. In the pop-up window, select one of the existing projects or click Create new project and type in the new project's name. OK, now let's input the API key in the corresponding field and save the changes. Now we can add a map to our web page using JetElements. To do it, please navigate to Pages, All Pages and click Edit with Elementor option for the selected page. We need to add a new section where we will place our advanced map module. Please scroll this page down and click Add new section button. Select the section structure, then you can edit the section to make it full width. I enable stretch section option and select the full width content width. After that, we need to drop the advanced map jet elements module to the section. Here we go. In the content settings, you can change the initial zoom scale for the map you want to show. The scroll wheel zoom option allows zooming in and out the map when you scroll it. The zoom controls allow the visitors zoom the map in and out using them. The street view controls allows enabling the street view by dragging the pavement to the map. The map tile controls are needed if you want the visitors to be able to switch from simple map view to satellite view. You can also define if you want the map to be draggable or not. In the Map Style section, you can change the map height in pixels and set one of the pre-made map styles from the drop-down styles list. Just try out several of them to learn which style suits the most. In Pins block, you can remove or add new location pins. To add a new pin, you need to click Add Item button and then input the pin location address and its title in the description field. Well, that's actually all. Let's save the changes and navigate to View page to see what we have now. Alright, here is our new map added with Advanced Map Element's module. Thanks for watching our tutorial!